Hi, I'm going to give an introduction to how the travel log works for Stentor Game. If you haven't already seen an introduction to the game, there's another video for that on our YouTube channel. So, the travel log is a history of quests that you've completed as a player. And you get to it up here if you click the shield symbol from your game menu and then select travel log. I'm just going to pop this in the middle of the screen. In fact, because there's quite a lot of noise going on, I think I'm just going to move into another zone where it's less noisy. I'm just going to click on the game window to let me move. I can do anything that I can normally do in the game even though the travel log is open. I just move it around independently of the normal game window. Okay, so here comes the travel log again. <laughs> so this character is called Susie and she's got um, one, she's got five quests still open that she needs to finish and if you click on the name of the quest then you find out what you still need to do. Let's have a look at Help Mrs Yeti. There's a title of the quest and then a description so it explains what the quest is about and then the steps that you've already taken. So in this case Susie hasn't actually done very much. She's met Mrs Yeti and Mrs Yeti asked her to go to some other person to get a special love potion and Susie hasn't done anything else. Um, if you want to see more examples of steps that have been completed then we could actually look in the fully completed quests because then you should see a little bit more information. Let's try campfire. Campfire is about taking some wood to a girl that needs it to light her campfire and there you can see everything that happened. You met Sally, you agreed to help her, you found the wood, you gave her the wood. She gave you food in return, it explains how much experience points you earned and now actually Sally's fire needs some wood again so I could probably return to Sally. So as you can see Susie's completed really quite a lot of quests. Uh, there's so many quests available. Um, there's still more she's got open and what's not listed here is quests that haven't been started at all because Susie hasn't met the right person. The last tab is called production and it's for orders that you've placed with an NPC to get stuff made. Uh, it looks like Susie needs to go and pick up some iron from the ironsmith uh, and that's the only thing that she's got left open. Once your order has been collected then it disappears which is why you don't see much more here. So that's all, just a brief introduction to your travel log. It's available from this menu and it helps you understand and remember what you need to complete for a quest that you've been asked to do. That's all. Thanks. Bye.